Korean dramas have taken the world by storm with intriguing plots, captivating storylines, and several different genres to choose from. The trend this year, though, seems to be the law dramas. Law drama fans really got loads of content to watch, but other genre fans are not to be disappointed because with law dramas, this year was also packed with action and wholesome romance dramas. If you're not sure about the romance part I just said. How about the drama that broke hearts? The one about age? Yes, you guys know what I'm hinting at, right? We'll see it in the list for sure. Hi guys and welcome back to Acme Octopus. In today's video, we'll talk about top dramas to watch in the year 2022. If you haven't watched any of these, let me tell you you're missing out a lot. The year 2021 had a lot of outstanding dramas that the fans couldn't stop talking about such as The Squid Game, Hometown Cha Cha Cha, Our Beloved Summer, Mr. Queen, Doom at Your Service, and the list just goes on. When you think of all these big names, the general idea would be that it must have been hard to break through the next year with dramas this good in the previous year. The dramas in 2022 did just that. They broke through the K-drama community with a phenomenal star cast, top-notch acting, and such unique plots that you just can't stop watching. Let's get into the list to see what I'm talking about. 10. Love All Play Did I really forget to mention that a sports drama also emerged in 2022 that was absolutely perfect? Well, here it is. It's a sports romance drama about two players from the badminton team. The chemistry between the cast is phenomenal. A drama like this always has you excited at not just the romance aspect of it, but also the sports part of it along with questions like who's going to get the girl. You also wonder who's going to win this match. It's just a perfect combination for a well-placed drama that doesn't bore you out. Park Tae-joon, who just naturally ends up playing badminton, has his desire to win ignited as he wishes to impress the girl he likes. On the other hand, Park Chae yang is a former aspiring Olympian who had to leave the badminton world for three years after a bribing scandal. The two meet and sparks fly as they work to balance their game and love life at once. 9. Why Her Among many other good law dramas, Why Her had our complete attention with its cast and a storyline that had you absolutely at its twists and turns. The mystery it has going on along with the romance that shows a couple figuring out how to tackle the age gap they've got going on is truly eye-catching. We get to see So Hyun Jin as Oh Soo Jae. Wang in Yop as Gong Chan, the handsome male lead, and Bae in Hyuk as Choi Yoon Sang, giving us a major second lead syndrome. The story is about our lawyer, Oh Soo Jai, who is talented without a doubt, but unfortunately gets caught up in an unexpected case, leading her to get demoted from working at a top law firm to being a professor at a law college. There she meets Gong Chan, a student who falls in love with her and would do anything to protect her. Although Su Jai tries to keep her distance, Gong Chan just keeps pulling at her heartstrings. 8. Ghost Doctor The Ghost Doctor has an interesting storyline and is a much watch for fantasy fans out there. If you're tired of watching the same genre again and again, be sure to check this one out. The comedy aspect has you rolling with laughter. The drama doesn't heavily focus on the romance between two leads, but it focuses mostly on fantasy between ghosts and one living doctor. The best part of this drama is the bromance between Cha Young Min, a genius but arrogant doctor whose spirit possesses the body of another doctor who is his polar opposite. The clumsy resident doctor getting a hand by a genius doctor's soul is bound to give you great comical senses, and that is exactly what happens. The series has its fair share of comedy and mystery, but what pulls at our hearts is the focus on how to deal with the afterlife. 7. Tomorrow Tomorrow is another feel-good fantasy series for which just 16 episodes were not enough. The series, along with the fantasy aspect of it, also talked about numerous social issues. The series had an excellent cast and we saw some praiseworthy character developments. There was comedy throughout, but the emotional aspect of it had fans more intrigued along with the compelling storyline. The story is about a guy who accidentally ends up being a half-human and half-spirit and is employed by a company of grim reapers in the underworld that carry out special missions. A little good news for Tomorrow fans is that there are talks of Season 2. 6. Alchemy of Souls Another fantasy drama that although didn't gain as much popularity in Korea, had its fair success in the international world. This drama received backlash from some, but in the end, it just depends on your taste because for me it wasn't a bad watch at all. 
There were some parts I thought were dragged out, but the incense mystery storyline and the comedy aspect of it had me hooked till the end. Season 2 is also on the way. The casting honestly couldn't get any better. The story is about young mages as they overcome their twisted fates due to a forbidden magic spell called Alchemy of Souls, which allows souls to switch bodies. The series is a perfect blend of adventure, fantasy, comedy, and romance. The directions and the special effects did justice to the storyline. Be sure not to miss out, fantasy fans. 5. All of Us Are Dead Now, this is something for action fans. Love zombie apocalypse? Horror? Well, you've got the perfect drama. All of Us Are Dead broke through with a fresh cast that immediately gained attention with their great acting skills. The story focuses on some high school students trapped inside their school building that has become ground zero for a zombie virus outbreak. If you watch Kingdom, be sure to check this out. Imagine being at your school having a normal day and suddenly a student from the science lab has turned into a zombie. Oh, the thrill this drama gave us was beyond what I've experienced in a while. With 12 episodes and guess what, a season two on the way. It was interesting to see the relationships between the students as they struggle to survive. 4. Big Mouth I've got a lot to say about this drama, but let's try to make this short, shall we? It's safe to say that Big Mouth is still the talk of the town where you just have to discuss how it progresses. The series was a perfect depiction of what a mystery thriller law drama looks like. The romance was so wholesome. And there's just something about married K-drama couples that puts us in a trance. Their moments, though short-lived, were sweet and had us wanting more. The story is about an unsuccessful lawyer played by Lee Jong-suk, rather perfectly, who gets involved in a murder case and is somehow pointed to as the genius swindler Big Mouse. The ending is what puts us all in a turmoil of emotions. While some call it the perfect ending, others argue that it could have a different and better outcome. 3. A Business Proposal In my opinion, cliches never really run out for business, even after watching loads of other genres. Your heart just can't take it anymore, and you return to watch a good cliché from time to time. This is your perfect watch. Outstanding romance, comedy, and a boss-employee romance are sure to attract attention. This drama is based on a manhwa of the same name. The story follows the love lives of two best friends, in disguise for her best friend Hari shows up for a blind date where she plans to scare the guy away. But plans go awry as the guy turns out to be the CEO of the company she works at. And the most exciting part? What if he makes a proposal she can't refuse? A must-watch for classic rom-com fans. 2. Extraordinary Attorney Wu Looking for a drama with more focus on the law part? Well, I know there are a lot of good law dramas on this list, but this one tops them all with the perfect protagonist. Our cute protagonist, Wu Young Wu, is a young lawyer with a condition called Asperger Syndrome. She has made headlines with her high IQ and impressive memory. But even while having the perfect creative thought process for a lawyer, she struggles with everyday interactions with clients and her co-workers. Enter Lee Jun Ho, who works in the same law firm as Wu Young Wu. He's every girl's dream guy and is quite popular with his looks. Lee Jun Ho takes a liking to this extraordinary attorney and a sweet heartwarming romance begins as along with performing her lawyer duties, Wu Young Wu now gets to experience a roller coaster of emotions called romance that she has never felt before. And the best part? Season 2 has been confirmed. 1. 2521 Yes, this is the drama I've been hinting at, the one that broke our hearts completely. With its bittersweet ending, fans had mixed opinions about how it ended, but no one could deny that overall, this drama was a masterpiece. The cast? With Nam Jo Hyuk and Kim Tai Ri, the drama was already highly anticipated, but the impeccable storyline had us all singing praises for it long after it ended. This coming-of-age story is about a young teenage fencer, Na Hui Do, who at the time, when dreams seem out of reach, pursues big ambitions. And along the way, she meets a hard-working young man, Baek Il Jin, who seeks to rebuild his life. The cinematography is a plus point for this drama, and you're bound to be hooked. This drama taught us the raw and pure meaning of love through its refreshing, soothing, and inspiring storyline. That's it for today, but there are some dramas I wanted to mention that also played a role in making 2022 a good year for K-dramas. So here we go, again my life. Our Blues, Juvenile Justice, The Sound of Magic, Link, Eat Love Kill, Eve, 
forecasting love and weather. If you wish upon me, dear M, Anna. I hope you enjoyed the video. If I've missed your favorite K-drama, make sure to mention it in the comments below. I'd love to hear your opinions. Please give this video a big thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon for more interesting videos. See you in the next video.